It's good practice to clean the sprayer immediately after use. A clean sprayer is safe, it won't be damaged by residues, it's ready to use, and you avoid crop damage. Cleaning starts by reading and understanding the pesticide label and the sprayer cleaning instructions before you go spraying. Some pesticides require deactivating agents or specific cleaning procedures. And some pesticides are extremely active even at low concentrations. So here cleaning is especially important. The pesticide has no specific cleaning requirements. So I'll just follow the instruction manual guidelines. Basically, I just have to flush a sprayer three times. I have 500 litres of clean water in the rinse tank and I'll start by doing the external cleaning. Don't use more than a third of the rinse tank water. If you want to reduce the water uh, usage, reduce the pump RPM. I now circulate the liquid in the main tank and through all the lines. Give it enough time to circulate before going to the next position. The safety valve should also be forced to open. People usually forget to drain this line out. It usually makes a noise when it opens. I'll repeat the flush procedure with half of the liquid left in the rinse tank. I have now flushed and sprayed the liquid out three times. Let's see what's in the tank. Ah, that looks like a job well done. By cleaning your sprayer correctly, you protect your sprayer, your health and your crops.